don't see any gold. I don't, but it's heavier than it should be. Inside of the mill. <laughs> well, if they were crushing quartz to get the gold. Here's what they were after. So the quartz was from the interior of the island, and this was where they processed it with cyanide. Boy, that one's a bit rusty. So you can see the iron on it. That's a nice piece. See how it's all bubbly, wormy. some quartz right there. Let's see if there's a piece dug here. Oh, success. Ooh. Look at him. Here's iron. I'd like to take that. And just set that side in vinegar and then see what shows through. It's not bad there either. If I had my truck, I'd be taking that, but I'm not going to take that in the airplane. Grab those two. I might come back for this one. That's a better sample. <laughs> Here's my little stash of rocks. I don't, in the jeweler's optic, see anything that really excites me, except associated with this black on all the rocks, there seems to be perhaps little, little tiny specks. Now at this mine, they originally tried to extract the 
gold from the crush using mercury and that was somewhat unsuccessful and they were more successful and profitable when they did it using cyanide so it may be very very small gold but what I do notice is there's little bugs and some of them are a bit little bit crystalline inside so I'll tell you what I'm thinking rather than haul this stuff home what I'm going to do is try to crack them Turning big rocks into little rocks. So on this one, it's a little bit right there too. Golly, that's small. <laughs> Can't pay for your vacation with that. Really shiny thing right there. So this is the top off my goggles case from scuba diving. Kind of like a pan. Kind of like pay dirt. Okay. Yeah, so one little speck. There. Nice shiny gold. So if you want to visit that site, yeah, you need a heck of a lot more rock than this. And some better processes. But really, it's just a tourism place now.